the bomb song. You two. Watch the TY38. Yeah. Party yeah. move. The white guy, he came to the dope. Yeah. Him. He got the stand up special out there. Don't touch my lens. What did it do, Lee Lee G? Can we go to the old fish place? What fish place? That, that you said that we were just going to go. What fish place? I don't know. I want to go Oh, oh, out back, out back something. Who? Outdoor. Aquarium? What, what, what are you the talking out, about? Outdoor. Outdoor. Oh, uh, you talking about uh, Bass Pro Shop? Oh, you want to go to the gun? Oh, you want to go there? You want to go to the gun store? Yeah. See, these kids just be thinking they can strike out under this mall. Look, they got this little dragon breath stuff right here. It's just like, once you eat, yeah, ja Jasmine had it before. It's, it's all right, bro. Yeah, it ain't really done too much. You know what I mean? so, nah, we ain't doing that, girl. I got money to spend on other stuff. Here go the bathroom over here. Come on. I got your sunglasses for you real quick. You know what I mean? I like the phone cases, some pretty cool phone cases right here. It's right there, Lee, Tally. They got that Bob Marley hard. Look at that Bob Marley. Don't touch something, put him down. They got Jesus. Right beside the G. They got it next to the masonry. They got that Black Mamba. I like that though, that's hard. That lion, the lion face. Yeah. That's super hard. Yeah, that's super hard. That's a pretty cool. They got the Punisher. That Kobe Bryant pretty hard though right there. That mamba, that black mamba. Black mamba. They got the Goku. They really just build out wood and just put it on a, a laminate. A lamination. Don't none of y'all gotta go to the bathroom, do y'all? What is that? Right there. Y'all go to the restroom, me lot. I got my homeboy Ty out here with me. You know, I'm trying to get him back on the vlog and stuff, man, because I, I default finna leave me, man. So. Uh, Where you going? He finna move to New Orleans, man. For real? Yeah. Kind of okay, sad. Come through and he stay, he stay I busy. hope he do. Yeah. I think he will. More than likely. Stop touching the phones, y'all, please. But they uh say y'all over here stealing some shit. Cause y'all look black. You know what I mean? Hey, we got you with covered. Yes, sir. Hey, 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 definitely check out that special though. They got them embroidery hats right here. You can get you some special hat back look at face man. This we need right here for the uh They got the a mouthful. See we need one of these machines right here. You know what I mean? Definitely need one of these. Don't touch that. Definitely need one of these machines right here. One of them cool ass embroidery. Yeah, just want to show them the cool Legos. I buy them Legos, but they don't take the time to want to build them correctly. You know what I mean? I've been watching this guy here, Master Lego Builder on YouTube. Jesus, he's been doing like the cities and stuff on Lego. It's crazy. How intricate that is, like the numbers and the blocks. And like I watched the guy just build a Spider Man here. Yeah, it's crazy. Like it looks round. It really looks round. So, yeah. Thank you. How long you work for Lego? Uh, this is the summer. You Lego in? Okay. I want to go so bad. Okay. It, it does. What's up, babe? Little jump set? Oh, okay. Look at that right there. Look like you got Miles Davis in there. I mean, pretty cool Lego set. I know my homeboy Andrew. He'd probably love to put something together like that. Look at the DeLorean over here. As soon as I seen that, I was like, that's a dancing mango right there. This is cool. He got all this cool stuff in his Lego set up, bro. Look at that. They got, they got uh, electric Legos now. Yep. They actually moving stuff, cars. I told you, remember I was showing you the train. Remember I was just showing you the train. Dude had the train moving. This be cool, like you put your whole little city together. I can see you did it something like this, man. Oh, yeah. Dude, look at that, that stadium. That stadium, nice. Now, Ike the Tide was dope, too. Look, all that dope. The, uh, the Coliseum, that's pretty dope, too. I like this. 
pretty cool right there. Mm, you see the price though? What's up, baby? It's iconic right what? there. Look how, much they, look how much they want for that. $239. How is that I know, I'm just showing you. I actually got one. Of one of the Does it work? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. That's something I can see you probably. Yeah, I know, right? I love that. He's a roller coaster. Now that's my speed right there. I'm at the whole That's nice. That is super nice. Yeah, I know. I kept smelling it. I know you had it behind you. Yeah, look at that John Deere tractor. That's pretty cool right there. That's pretty cool. You like that, Nate? So they got a pencil thing. You like that? I know so you bought it. You like that? It costs too much, but if you find one of these Lego, you find something in here that costs a pretty decent value for your birthday. Like this, I buy this for your birthday. If you want this, you just gotta put it together. So find something you want for your birthday and I'll make sure I get it. Look at this one, that's pretty cool. You like that? That's you want for your birthday? Excuse me, y'all. Hey, Tally, look. I can, I'm a, I come get the rest of them. That's, that's the whole set, I think. See, look. Oh, look at this. Wow. Hey, what's that? What's that? So if you're just looking for specific Legos, you can actually find them over here. That's actually pretty cool. It's called Pick a Bill. So if you're actually looking for just like a specific color, number, or something like that, I assume they got them for you. You can get you a large, you can get your large cup for $15.99 or you get your regular for $8.99. They actually got some cool little stars. You know what I mean, that's pretty cool, little stars. You know, they got some eyeballs, some eyelashes. They got a bunch of different Legos, and it's pretty cool. I ain't gonna lie, they got a bunch of interesting Legos. They actually got, they actually got the Hulk Buster right here. That Hulk Buster is look pretty damn cool. They ain't got Miles Morales. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Got Venom over here. Look, y'all, Venom. That's dope. That is dope. We got the Black Panther right here. Wakanda forever. <laughs> but we ain't staying them all long. We went to the Lego store. Get some Legos. We gotta go do this other interview. But I'm gonna get back out here and finish this vlog, man. D4, what it doing, man? What up? Alright, y'all, my roundabout is we here in Green Hills Mall. I just came into the store. What's the name of the store again? Psycho Bunny. And I I heard this place like three weeks ago, but my business partner said he knew of him for a while. So I just came to the store and the young man right here, what's your name? David. Dave is dropping a lot of info, so I asked him, could I turn on camera? He said yes, so that's the best thing about this. So David, so uh, what were you saying about Psycho Bunny? How long have they been yeah, around? So like since like 2005. Okay. Um, you can only find us at like Dillard's or like Nordstrom, Bloomingdale's, that kind of thing. Um, and then in 2019, uh, they were like, 
let's try a pop-up store down in Aventura, Florida. Okay. It blew up from there. They opened up like multiple stores in Florida. Uh, we're based out of New York. Ah. Oh. Um, but then we recently moved our home office to Canada. Okay. So, okay. Um, it's a half like UK brand, half US because two of the founders, one was from the UK, okay. one was from here. So, okay. Okay. For sure. So, 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 so what's the whole the whole thing behind the psycho bunny like? Um. So essentially, essentially they they kind of was like we want something classic, but we want a little twist on it, right? So, okay. Psycho Bunny, they kind of was just playing with ideas. They thought of the crossbones, but they were like, nah, it's a little too harsh. So it was like, how can we make it a little bit more soft? Okay. That's where the money came from. All right. And the name, they were just playing with the titles. So before you worked here, did you hear about the, did you know anything about the brand? Not as much as I know now. Okay, okay, um, okay. But I have seen the little logo. The logo before. Dad okay, Bunny, okay, okay. So do you wear the clothes? You do. That's what you got on. Okay. Yeah, that's a pretty nice yeah, shirt yeah, too. They, okay. This is, uh, so they sell like, all pants. They sell pants, everything. They sell pants, joggers. They sell joggers. Swim okay. Trunks, okay. Um, underwear. Kids. Kids. Okay. Um, okay. We test out women's wear. It's mainly okay. men's. Okay. Okay. So you're, you're trying to cross over to the women's yes. apparel. Yes. Men's and that's what a lot of I see. That's the thing about a lot of companies. Kind of sad that women are. More, it's more women on the earth than men, but it's like, <laughs> I don't understand how all these clothing brands have right. more men clothes than women clothes. It's like, I haven't understood why men have a crossed over. I mean, you know, these apparel brands have crossed over to appease into women, because you look at a place like Fashion Over, you'd be like, how the hell they blow up? <laughs> but then you think all they was about was the woman, and women, even if the clothes wasn't top quality, it was just a chance of buying something. And the, the, the weird thing is too, um, in the clothing, like, because I have an idea for a brand too. Okay. But in the clothing world, um, women aren't afraid to step into the boundary of... Try something different. And like, yeah. uh, gender bending clothes. Yeah. So like, just because it's like men's, uh, women are more comfortable with, like, like what she has well, on, women, right? Yeah, but see, women can wear all type of things, right. you know what I mean? So it's different, like even with the pants, like right now it's so weird, like I was telling somebody, it's kind of odd that men, we, we are going, like look at my jeans, I start really just start with jeans like this because I had a lot of women telling me like, all oh, the jeans feel a little bit better than, I usually wear bigger size yeah, jeans, yeah. but a lot of people tell me it looks a little bit better with the slim jeans, but then you look at most women, they starting to wear loose, baggy type jeans. It's like, yeah, that what's going like on? Like, right? like, yeah, and like, and, it's, and it's the boy like wearing like that dog on skinny bit. jeans. <laughs> 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 yeah, women are just more. And I see y'all got kids clothes too. Huh? Okay, that's pretty cool. All right. Well, I appreciate you dropping that information. This, this is a book about the store? Yes, I can actually you give you this. I'll be right back. Okay. You want that far back? Yeah, let me, yeah. Let me just check out this book real quick. See what they got in here. I guess it's just some material, a material book. It's a material book. Show the fabric and stuff. It's pretty cool. This thing, I don't think you would touch it. <laughs> you look, you went over there and touched it. <laughs> I want one of them type of machines right there. Take home version of oh, okay. Well, I appreciate that, man. All right. For sure. Your name is again is David. David. Well, I appreciate you, David. And uh, like I said, we in Psycho Bunny, and uh, we're gonna close this out right here. YouTube. Watch the TY38. Yeah.